In this video, we're gonna try a, literally a little bit of everything. Uh, Jamisha sends us these items from California, and Jamisha just sends me lots of different things, and then I just put them together however I want. There's no, absolutely no rhyme or reason to this video. It's just a bunch of things from Jamisha. So, this is the Nemo's Vanilla Birthday Cake with Buttercream Icing. This is the Bar Nana Dark Chocolate Organic Chewy Banana Bites. I have the Knott's Berry Farm, the, the Premium Cookies, Strawberry Shortbread. They look like thumbprint cookies on there. Mm -hmm. And these are the Cowtail Minis Strawberry Smoothie. So we've had strawberry, but we haven't had strawberry smoothie Cowtail, so... Um, they might be different. Uh, so... There's apparently a place in California called Dee Dee's Clothing Store. Well, Dee Dee's Clothing sells more than just clothing. Right, Please. like um, Marshalls or TJ oh, Maxx. Oh, yeah, TJ Maxx yeah. or stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, makes, that makes perfect sense now that you've said it that way. So, um, I, so, I believe the Nemo's cake was $1.49. And then she found, I, you know, it, I was really stupid. Because I wrote down the store, but I didn't say what item came from that store. So, that does absolutely no good. So, I do know Jamisha's at her job, they gave her the banana, uh, the whites, and the cookies. Oh, so that makes sense. So, the Nemo's must have been $1.49. And then, okay, the Cowtails were $1.25. That's what it was. Okay. And we have reviewed the Barnana... Um, the ones covered in peanut butter. We, we did a review of those a long time ago. Jamisha also sent those, but so that's why I just have this one in the video. So first we have the Nemo's Vanilla Birthday Cake with Buttercream Icing, Homemade Goodness Away From Home. It is a three ounce cake. One cake, 85 grams, is 320 calories, and these are made in San Diego, California. And um, I right. did... Let's see, see. Let me figure out how to um, I... <laughs> <laughs> I did uh, look up information on these cakes, and they are perfectly okay to be um, out of the refrigerator. I believe it's said for like 30 days, so that's really, really good. It smells, mm, I could smell good. it through the package. Yeah, it smells really nice. It smelled in the back, out of the, out of the package. <sighs> yeah, it smells like, it smells Cake. like a party. Uh, do you want thick side, thin side? Let's it does back. not matter. Let's go back here. Ooh, it's it's colorful. It's like a little confetti looking. Yeah. It tastes like a nice vanilla cake. Mm hmm It's um dense. That's exactly the texture's a little dense. Mm hmm Um but it's not dry. I was expecting it to be dry. It's not. Mm -hmm. um, no. It's not overly sweet either. It's not as sweet as you would think it would be looking at it. It looks like it would be very sweet. It's not. There is sweetness to it yeah. on the icing, but no, it's not like... It's um, not as sweet as like your traditional tub of icing though. No, I don't think so. And when Jamisha sent it, I've had it in the refrigerator just because a lot of times when you buy these Nemo cakes, you find them in the refrigerated section of like uh, Speedway, uh, gas stations, stuff mm -hmm. like that. Um, so it's cold. I like, I it, like cold, it cold too. Uh, but I can see where it would be good at room temperature as well. It has. A, it's a nice vanilla cake. Yeah. yeah, it's not. It's not bad at all. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with it, but it's not necessarily any better than. I mean, a little Debbie has some really good. The white fancy cakes or zebra cakes are That's just true. as good as that. It would honestly. probably be cheaper, honestly, to buy a little Debbie. <laughs> little, Debbie. I do. little Debbie's probably well, it's a dollar something. You can buy for this, twice that. You can get a whole box. This seems though more substantial. It probably is. It feels yeah. like you you're get not going to eat as fast. That's for sure. Right. It feels like you're getting more with that Nemo's cake That's true. than you do a little Debbie. That's true. All right. So these. Are the dark uh, Barnana the Super Banana Snack Dark Chocolate Organic Chewy Banana Bites, um, soy free, grain free. I'm not looking for them. They're upcycling bananas to reduce waste. When bananas are not perfect, they go to waste, but not anymore. We turn them into tasty snacks. So these are uh, vegetarian, grain free. Uh, let's see, they are uh, 1.4 ounce, 40 grams, 180 calories. 
What size should I get? I got one about that size. I'll get that size. Yeah, you don't want anything big. Well, when we tried these before, the ones that are coated in peanut butter, I like them. And I'm thinking Andrew was in that review with us. I can't imagine I don't think, liking it. I don't think you or Andrew liked them. Mm -hmm. I do not like that let's open a banana and sit it on the counter for about an hour flavor. I just don't like it. Don't like it. And then this has got dark chocolate. It's very bitter. Mm -hmm. And I like it. Mm -hmm. I, think, mm -hmm. yeah, I that's do. That's awful. I would never touch another one of those. It reminds you, the texture of it reminds you of when they take a... Um, like a uh, blueberry or, or these uh, companies that sell blueberries or cranberries and they dip them in uh, chocolate. It has a hard, um, it has a firm, it's not hard. It's a firm outer uh, shell of that dark chocolate. And then you get the banana on the inside. I really like it, but I don't have a big hang up about a brown banana. I don't I don't dislike that flavor. Kevin genuinely dislikes that flavor. I hate it. Whereas I don't have anything <laughs> against it. I I prefer a yellow banana. Yeah. Well, but I, mean, I don't you can, mind. You're holding up a banana stack and it's black. There's a problem. <laughs> I, I think they're very good. Um, so Jamisha, I like them. So these are Knott's Berry Farm. We have reviewed Knott's Berry Farm cookies before, but not the strawberry. These are strawberry shortbread premium cookies. They are 240 calories for a 57 gram package. And I'm Ripped just- it like a savage. Yes, I did. Okay. They're a nice size uh, cookie. Yeah, they're kind of like those little thumbprint cookies. A little bit different. That has almost a, a fried flavor. Mm. Um, think of this, think of this in your mind while you're eating that. Funnel cake. I'm thinking vanilla. Funnel cake. Fried. I can see why you think that. Fried vanilla funnel cake. Yeah, to That's me, what it reminds me of. that tastes like vanilla. Yeah, I don't get strawberry. I don't get strawberry at all. Not even a little like a, bit. It tastes like something fried, like a funnel cake. The center part of it, the, the strawberry part, is like, it's really like gummy. Mm -hmm. It's kind of tacky. Like a thumbprint cookie would yes. be. Yes. Yeah. Um, but I really do like the vanilla that they put in their shortbread. I don't mind I that. think it's good. It's just, doesn't. It doesn't have any strawberry. It doesn't have any strawberry <laughs> flavor, but I don't, you mind, don't that. mind that. No, um, it, I don't mind it, but it doesn't have strawberry. That's for sure. Okay, these are Cow Tails, a chewy strawberry smoothie flavored caramel with a cream center. They're peanut free. This is that uh, Goats, Goats' brand, G-O-E-T-Z-E apostrophe S. We've reviewed them before. So you get 12 of them, strawberry smoothie, four ounces, uh, doo -doo -doo, three pieces, 28 grams is 120 calories. That's good. Manufactured by Goats's Candy Company in Baltimore, Maryland. This kind of thing would be good to hang out at Halloween. Oh, she's got a knife. Let's put her to the hospital. Okay, here we go. What, take me to the hospital? I, I got an did order. fine. Take me I did fine. Fine, fine. No, I do remember my dad one time on Thanksgiving. Do you remember? Carved himself instead of a turkey. He did. He did. Had to go um, get stitches on Thanksgiving. How did he do that? Whoop. Cutting turkey or ham up. Was it? Mm hmm. I like the texture of those. I do too. I was expecting Twizzler to like mm -hmm. tough. It's not, it's really soft. No. I don't even what, what you would compare that to. Because it's not taffy, like it's not sticky enough or hard. It's not gummy. It's almost like a fruit snack, almost. Mm -hmm. Almost. But those are even a little stickier. 
This is like that. very, very soft, mm -hmm. but it's chewy. Doesn't get stuck in your teeth. It almost has a grittiness to it, so you can take it, grind it between your teeth, and it's really, really... It's satisfying. It's very satisfying. I like it. Um, now... I don't like... I like these much better than I did the... the is it chocolate? I think it's chocolate. I don't like those as much because they have that artificial chocolate flavor. Um, these taste better. See, we've had them too where they were they were supposed to be Oreo, and I'm thinking we didn't taste any Oreo no, whatsoever. No, no. They like chocolate and white cream. Basically. Yeah, they like had the name Oreo on them, and it's like, uh, hello, where is the Oreo? Yeah. Um, these are okay. I like them. I they're would, not strong enough strawberry flavor for me, but they're good. Right. Warm. I think the it, because it's that smoothie, it, it, whatever that is, that it lightened the flavor. It yeah, took away a, from the strawberry it's flavor. Like cream in the um, but I love the texture of that. That's terrific. Mm -hmm. I like them. I would eat them. Yeah, I, I, would, I would definitely eat them. There's other sweet them. snacks I'd rather have, but I'll, I do like them. These are all so very, very different. You cannot compare them. Uh, well, I can tell you I would never eat those banana things again. And see, I, I really, um, and I could eat the whole bag. I'm uh, not even kidding. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm going to pick those as my choice. I know. How can he have ever person. married crazy person. somebody as um, nutty as me? I'm gonna pick the bananas. Which, which one would I actually go to? I'd probably do the cow tails. The cow tails. Um, but I didn't mind the cookies at all. And the cake is good. I think for me, it's more of a, I'd really have the convenience of like a little Debbie, but I do think this is really, really good. I do too. Uh, we've had uh, a bunch of different Nemo's cakes. We've reviewed them on the channel. So if you're curious, Tammy Dunn Nemo's, they'll come up. Um, I think this is one of the better ones that we've Yeah, had. it's got a good I flavor. Really yeah, and the texture and everything's good. It's just something I, I wouldn't go towards that all the time. And if you don't mind these just tasting like vanilla and no strawberry flavor whatsoever, You'll yeah. like those too. Uh, I just really didn't get, and you didn't either no, get the strawberry. No um, but thank you so much to Jamisha for this fun video. It's always fun to try mm -hmm. uh, all kinds of different things in a video. So I hope you all enjoyed it too, and thanks for watching.